So I drive a lot of rental cars. I'm actually quickly approaching my 300th rental. And in that time, I've developed some really strong opinions about key fobs. And I was curious if you share those same opinions. So let me show you seven different fobs, and I want you to tell me which one you like best. All right, so the first key is from the 2019 Chrysler Pacifica. This is a minivan key, which is why there's so many buttons on it. It's kind of a rectangular shape, and it has some really nice weight to it, which, uh, which I tend to like a lot. After that, we've got the 2019 Toyota Corolla key. Super light, only four buttons on it, and it does have a physical key on it. Despite that, it works pretty well and uh, fits in your pocket pretty easily. After that, we got the 2018 Hyundai Elantra GT key. This thing feels very plasticky. It's not really a word, but it's got a flip-out key, and it's really light, which I don't tend to like that much. After that, we got the 2019 Chevy Malibu key. This is one of my favorites. It's really heavy. It's actually got some metal on it, and the buttons don't really stick out, so it's kind of kind of a cool feel to it. After that, we got the 2019 Nissan Sentra key, oval shape, four buttons, made out of plastic, super, super light, uh, but it fits in your pocket really easily, which is a big plus. Next up, we got the 2019 Mitsubishi Outlander key, another super light key, only three buttons on it, lock, unlock, and a panic button, and a physical key on this one, kind of wide too. And last up, we got the 2018 excuse me, Ford Escape circular shape to it only three buttons on it lock unlock and a panic button and again a physical key so my top two are the chevy malibu key which i really like because it doesn't have actual raised buttons on it and it has some actual metal in the key itself which gives it a nice weight to it and i also like the pacifica key again because it's got kind of a heavy feel to it and it just feels like it's made out of better quality materials Anyway, that's just me. If you disagree or agree, please let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear your opinion on this. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you join me next time when I'm back to renting and reviewing a rental car. I'll see you then.